Hi. Since you guys are discussing a sleeve valve engine, I'd like to show you a little bit about this HP engine. It's made in Austria, clearly says so on the motor mount. Uh, this, is a, this is a glow engine, there's a glow plug. Uh, the cylinder rotates with this gear train. Now there's a single hole in the sleeve and it rotates around and I can't even describe how it rotates around and I can't take it apart it's all it's all froze up with the uh, uh, castor oil and the fuel um, and I'm not gonna free it up but I thought you'd like to see the gear train there's a bevel gear down at the bottom I've had that apart before and then there's a, a small pinion up here uh, this is a four-stroke engine and the intake's in the front. It does does suck in fuel, and it did run. However, this uh, this engine has a lot of lot of uh, uh, running time, and maybe misuse. Who knows? Uh, the compression isn't very high, and it doesn't produce a lot of power compared to uh, the Sato engines and the other uh, overhead valve four-stroke engines. Sato produces a fine engine I believe but uh, I just thought I'd show you this the uh, valve cover and this is actually what it is is a valve cover uh, this ring with the slot in it um, the slot is there I'm sure to uh, to uh, allow uh, lubrication to the upper part the uh, muffler actually produces a suction on this hose and uh, you know maybe maybe it's uh, uh, bypass gases pushing it out but uh, when it's running you can see the black uh, used up castor oil flowing to the muffler um, through this uh, silicone hose uh, like I say I, I, I'm not going to take it apart but uh, there, there is a sleeve that rotates around the piston and uh, this is the problem I think you're going to run into with a uh, compression ignition diesel. You're going to have to have very tight tolerances, very tight uh, uh, piston fit to get the compression. And the contra piston also has to be very tight. I've run uh, quite a number of diesel uh, model airplane engines and the contra piston usually is pretty well froze up. Uh, most of the time, if you can get it running at all, the contra piston will uh, be forced up against the adjusting screw. And if you've looked at other diesel engines, you'll find there's an adjusting screw in the middle of the head pushing down on the contra piston. Uh, I wish you luck, but I, I don't see how you're going to be successful with a sleeve valve. Uh, more power to you. Good luck. I mean, you know, I, I hate to be so negative, but uh, uh, my experience with, with this engine, uh, I, I wouldn't bother trying to find a new uh, HP sleeve valve engine. You know, I bought this used off a guy, and it, I, I did run it, uh, but like I say, it produced very little power. It, uh, it's basically a low compression is the problem, and... Uh, well, that's the size of it. So, good luck. Anyways, I'm going to put this thing back together and put it back on the shelf since, uh, you know, it's not worth much. Anyways, talk to you later.